Hi everybody, this is Joe with Joe's Premium Firewood, bringing another fun-filled, exciting video. Today's video, I'm going to go over the costs and labor involved in producing uh, bundles that I sell to the campground and uh, other places, you know, uh, Pine Lake Grocery, and once in a while other people come and buy them, you know, from my driveway stand. But um, here's all the, all the bundles that I've uh, made over the last... I'd say 10 days or so. There's uh, 200 bundles right there. And I sell it for $600. But let's go over the costs. So when uh, JPF employee Gary and I, we drive to Hastings, Michigan, which is about 25 miles from here, it takes about $10 in gas. And then uh, it takes us each about a, it takes about a half an hour for both of us to cut and load the wood. I do all the cutting, he does all the loading. And so there's a three man hours right there. And then we come back here, I, I give Gary $20 to help me cut a super sized truckload of, of ash rounds. And out of each one of those truckloads, I, I, I would say I've been averaging about 67 bundles once they're all split. So that comes out to 200 bundles. So we'll just figure the cost for 67 bundles. I know it's 201, but just let's just try to keep numbers uh, numbers even for my sake. So what we'll do is we'll come back here and we'll stage them right in front of this rack, right by the splitter, and then Gary will split them. So that takes him about three hours to split. So I give him another 30. So now I'm, I'm into it. For 67 bundles, I've already spent $60. Then when I go to do the delivery, it I probably have about a half hour time loading and unloading, plus the drive over there and back. I'm using another $10 in gas. So that takes another 10 off. So that's $70 in expense. And then the, the string that I use, I, I would say probably for every 67 bundles, it's probably $5 worth of string. So there's $75. So to get $200, I got to spend 75 and and work about seven hours. Now, if you count, you count drive time, that's uh, that's even more, you know, that then it comes out to, you know, 10, 10, 11 hours total that I have into it. So as you can see, I'm not getting rich. I think at seven, you know, if I have seven of my, hours into it you know i'm making about 12 or 13 dollars an hour maybe 14. so like i say again i'm not getting rich doing this you know and i'm probably making about the same amount i make just for uh doing regular oversized truckloads you know profit wise um so, so i'm not you know but but these the they are they are my biggest customer the um campground they probably buy about seven thousand dollars worth of wood a year so to keep money coming in during the summer i i go ahead and do this although it takes a lot of time so i'm going to give you some uh that should answer your question so 75 bucks and seven hours of my time and i make 125 dollars of my working time not driving time but uh yesterday the the uh, splitter was uh leaking gas or not gas leaking hydraulic fluid you can see how it's all wet there it had a cut in there probably before i uh put this table on a log fell down on that's a very poor design i don't know why it's not here in the side and uh i paid my brother 10 bucks to uh to t take it off cut off an inch out of it and then bolt it back on so it took him about 10 minutes i think that's a fair price oh when i was at a uh, tractor supply I also bought that three quarter inch wrench because mine turned up missing and I, and I use it a lot, of, a, a lot of the time. So that's it for the bonus footage and pretty much it for the video. So I hope you enjoyed it. And as always, subscribe to my YouTube channel, like Joe's Premium Firewood on Facebook, share this video, like this video, and comment this video. Thank you.